number one. And there are six teams lining up. In fact, five teams. Dominican Republic are late with draws. They did have a team declared, Dominican Republic, but they are a DNS, as you can see there. So, a late problem for them, which means that five teams will contest the two places. India, therefore, are on the inside in lane four. This is not something you say too often. They have Rupal, Jatika Dandi, Vivama Matitira, and Suba Venkatissan. Running up for them. Germany, we've seen their male 4 by one sprinters go through. Lisa Smith, who ran in a mixed 4x4 four four earlier on this evening, and ran very well. Is back out about an hour and a bit later there in the women's 4x4 with Scotty Shear, Mona Mayer, and Hannah Mergenthaler. Jamaica, well, a poor day yesterday for them with only one team going through. The fortunes for them have improved this evening uh, with Cherokee Young, Venetia McGregor, Ashley Williams, and Janelle Bromfield. They have the same team but in a different order originally. Venetia McGregor will lead them off in this one, where Cherokee Young did yesterday. Brazil with Dos Santos Barreto, Leticia Lima. They were disqualified yesterday. Maria de Sena and Annie de Bassi, who also is running her second leg of the evening as well. And Colombia complete the lineup. The South American champions with Paolo Lamoa, Carrillo Velez, Rosana Palacios and Naomi Castro. So we saw yesterday some pretty successful doubling up from the likes of Natalia Kazmarek of Poland and Ireland's Rashida Adelaki and Charlie Maudsley who do go again in the mixed 4x4 for Ireland, by the way. They don't run in the women's 4x4 final later on. But uh, the athletes, a couple of them doubling up here. Alicia Smith of Germany on the opening leg. Ali de Bassi of Brazil on the anchor leg as well. We'll see what, see what they can do here, Daphne, with the, uh, the two in about an hour or so. Yeah, but yesterday we saw it with the Ireland girls, so maybe it's possible. So that was in some impressive, particularly out of Lakey yesterday, couple of, some 50 seconds twice in the space of a couple of hours. But, uh, they, they get led off with just one run this evening. So here we go then with the women's 4 by 400 meters Olympic qualifying round two. And the first of the three heats with just the five teams in it. Colombia on the outside. From Brazil. Jamaica, They've switched it all around. Actually, none of their runners are running the same leg that they ran yesterday. Jamaica, Alicia Smith to lead off Germany, and then come India. The Dominican Republic team, by the way, in uh, lane three didn't have Marilene Carlino, Carlino named in it. It's the four names that uh, had been submitted. They do not start, so five for the two places. have to expect the Jamaican quartet if they run to their ability here into their form this quartet should be strong enough to win this with some in hand you would think Set. So, Renisha McGregor leading them off. She ran the anchor leg yesterday. I mentioned they've all switched around positions. None of them in the same position on this occasion. Alicia Smith of Germany running that second leg of the evening has got them in their focus ahead, but Renisha McGregor has gone out best over the first 200 metres or so. Up for Brazil, Jenny Dos Santos Barreto outside them. India had some misfortune yesterday with their men's team uh, pulling up injured. Alicia McGregor. Three of these teams uh, haven't qualified a team from this championship so far, by the way. India, Brazil, and Colombia looking for their first passports to Paris. Germany finishing strong here. This is Alicia Smith in her second run of the evening, who's actually made it up on Renisha McGregor in the closing stages, who paid the price for that strong early start and a really good second leg of the night from Alicia Smith there has put Germany in the box seat ahead of Brazil and Jamaica. Colombia right on the outside and then India inside them. And the baton in the hand for Germany now of Skadi Shear. Jamaica have Cherokee Young, last night's lead-off runner. Brazil, the baton is in the hand of Leticia Lima. Gandhi has it for India, and it's Caravelles for Colombia. Germany, Jamaica and Brazil away from the rest at the moment. 
at the battle for second place as Lima tries to close down on Cherokee Young, who herself is now chipping away at Skadi Shia. This is a much better second leg from Jamaica. Much better judgment from Cherokee Young. And India coming strongly down the home straight as well with Gatika Gandhi to put them in contention. They're going to be pretty much level with Germany by the time they pass the baton over. Ashley Williams heads off for Jamaica. India now in second position, and Germany have gone right back there. They make a bit of a mess of the change there, Germany. They did, which in a 4x4 is inexcusable, really, although the lactic of the incoming runner can always be a factor. So Germany have put themselves right under pressure now. Jamaica with that lead that's just being closed down by India's third leg runner, Obama Majatira. Ashley Williams out front for Jamaica. Germany are having to work back with Mona Mayer, just trying to come around the outside of the Brazilian athlete, Maria De Sena. So Jamaica and India into the home straight, maybe a a bit of clear water that India might not have expected. They've got to hold on here because Germany are starting to try and close, but Brazil finishing strongly as well. Second spot not quite wrapped up yet, but Jamaica will hand on to Janelle Bromfield for this final leg. India in second, Brazil third, and Germany, their final leg hopes, rest with Hannah Mergentheimer. So Bromfield comfortable here, 20 metres or so ahead. The eyes are going to be on that battle for the second spot at the moment. Subar Venkatesa of India. For Brazil, it's Annie Debassi running her second leg of the evening in third position. Can Germany possibly get back from there with Hannah Mergentheimer? But Jamaica righting the wrongs of yesterday. Janelle Bromfield looking strong. India are not letting that gap at the moment close. Brazil looking the most likely. I think India have got enough in hand here. Janelle Bromfield just started to tie up in the home straight. India are closing, but they've both done enough. And Jamaica and India put their places in the women's 4x400 metres in Paris. Brazil finished third, Germany in fourth place. All you've got to do, Daphne, is deal with the hand that you're given. And India were given an advantage by that Germany changeover, and they made it go. With Jamaica, we expected them to be strong favourites. That was a good, a good example when it all comes together well for you there. We said that if they all run to their potential, as you'd expect them to do, Jamaica, an experienced quartet like that, that was a good performance. Jamaica's doing a really good job in these rounds because they are all true. Come to winners, Jamaica. Joining their teams who progressed a little bit earlier on. And India, that is the uh, the first team that India have won through here from World Athletics Relays Bahamas 2024. I mentioned there's a big Jamaican contingent here. And they are not quite making as much noise as the Bahamians when the uh, Bahamian mixed 4 by 4 team saw it through earlier on, but still a good reception for them. The Indian team, Rupo Bandi, Matatira, Venkatesan. Okay, and that was a, an effective performance from them. And we'll get their moment with the passport to Paris qualification banner as well. And Germany, well, it was the change between Shia and Maya, which hopefully we'll get a chance to see. Daphne, the new spotted at the time. Keep an eye on that as we have a little look back at the, uh, the changeovers. So this is the uh, this is the changeover here that went wrong. Yeah, she started a little bit too early because she was so much lactic in her legs. And what you can see in the last couple of meters was so difficult for her. And the, the incoming and the outgoing was like, okay, I need to go now, but that was a little bit too early. So she needs to stop and then wrap it and then go. That's the difficult thing of the product that meters. You need to wait, to wait, to wait. And the thing is, in the 4x4, I mean, it, it's, it's obviously, uh, you, you say it's the half a second that you lose by just checking your stride slightly or making sure you're slightly safe. There's obviously another 399 metres you can make that up, whereas in a 4x1, it's, it's obviously you've got to be ruthlessly efficient. In the 4x4, it, it's a surprising to see a team make a mess up like that. Yeah, the, the changeover is not that important. You have all the time to make it OK. You need to wrap it and go. That's, that's enough. Like, you cannot win that much time in it. Well, small margins, and unfortunately for Germany, that uh, costly change left Jamaica and India to come through and put their places at the Olympic Games.